A lot of us know how tough the job market is out there, and we are now joined by motivational coach and author, Dr. June, with some expert advice for all of us. First of all, thank you very much for being here. Thank you. And your big thing is turning negative think into positive action. Absolutely. I started and found it Time to App. That's A-P-T, Accentuate Positive Thinking. You know how you say act now? Yes. I say apt now. So, you know, you might start out, you probably don't have this, but you know, you may wake up with a bad hair day, you know, you always look great. Hold on. my day started, I lost a button at an instant copy, so I already posted that, oh, and now you're telling me no. that was the wrong way to start the day. That's, you know, sometimes you start out like that, you can't find your keys, you wake up late, and then you're like, how do I turn this around? I'm gonna tell you a secret. Two things you, ne you never do. You don't say, oh my goodness, what's gonna happen next? Oh, I can just see how this day is gonna go. You turn it around. You know what you say? This is going to be a day where something great is gonna happen. And you start thinking about that. Maybe you find 10 cents. Of course, I'm like, ooh, can you change that to $10? But whatever the case, you start trying to, to change that into hoping something positive will happen. Okay, I'm gonna have to rethink my day now. Uh, <laughs> let's talk about people who may be looking for work right now. How do they approach this? Well, you know, there's a lot of stress yes. with the job market, economy, and with my doing motivational coaching, I find that when I'm working with people with personal development and relationships, that kind of overlaps that career problem. So I came up with an idea, what I call is a handbook, on how to determine what might be a good career for you, how to actually go out and get that career. Because, you know, you, it's not so much the traditional job search. You know how you used to have the newspaper and you circle yeah. it? There's the internet now, and I believe that networking is also very important. Is that the book right here that we have in front that of us? That is the book. What is the name of the book, and if we can get a shot of it again, because I think it was up just before. No more career pity parties. No more career pity parties, and it's all yes. about turning, again, turning the negative thing into positive action. For your career, yes. You know how, and my husband teases me about being a breakup coach, but you know how in a re relationship you might think, should I stay, should I go, what do I do afterwards? And I have actually a chapter that talks about that, because you know, sometimes you may get into burnout. Maybe you're like, is this what I really need to do? So it's concise, you know, everything now, time is essential. It's concise and it talks about how to actually go for that job search to find what it is that you really want to do and if you should stay or go. Now, Dr. June, you have something coming up. What's coming up and where can we go and see you? I'm having a book signing party. It's open to the public. It is on September 27th at the Hampton Inns in Wesley Chapel, 11 to 1. Dr. June, thanks for being here. Thank you. I'm going to have to rethink my entire day now. And, yes. and take down that Facebook post. <laughs> Thank you very much. Ashley, back to you. All right. Thanks a lot. Still